Well, a big match in Jaipur tomorrow with Rajasthan Royals taking on Virat Kohli's RCB. Both teams haven't scored a win yet in the IPL and they'll be searching tomorrow. One will get off the bottom, one will stay. So the key issues for Rajasthan tomorrow are how they're going to deal with the form of Jada Vilnatkat. He's been a worry for Rajasthan. Um, Ajinka Rahane has kept him back deep and hasn't bowled him any time really before the 12th over. So bowling can, four consecutive overs at the back end is always going to be tough for a bowler and unfortunately he hasn't come up with the goods. So the likely 11 for me for tomorrow for the Rajasthan Royals is as such. So I've made a couple of changes. For me, they need to strengthen their bowling unit. They've struggled to take wickets. Their economy rate outside the power play has been an issue. So I've brought in Ish Sodi. Um, he's had a great record for the Rajasthan Royals at home, and he needs to get in there with the spinners, help go out, help Gotham, and I think he'll make a big impact. So Steve Smith goes out of the lineup for that. Manon Vora comes in, top order player to take that role at number three or four. Uh, I just think that they need to score, take some more wickets with some firepower, the Rajasthan Royals. So player to watch out for for me. Well, I'm going to go with... Ben Stokes, uh, for me, he played a great knock the other day, just couldn't get his team over the line, had a real impact, and I think he'll just go from strength to strength now. But I think, uh, look, it's going to be tough, but I think the RCB will just sneak home in this encounter. Uh, the return of Marcus Stoinis and uh, Nathan Coulton I will certainly uh, help RCB's cause, who've been woeful in this, uh, uh, in, in this IPL, unfortunately. The two will not only strengthen the batting, uh, but as all-rounders give their bowling a little bit of teeth, particularly Coulton Isle, uh, who's likely to provide that uh, firepower that RCB has been looking for. And they desperately need both those guys coming in and performing well. Uh, the 11 that I've picked for RCB, it's been a little bit, uh, little bit difficult to pick this 11, uh, considering how uh, up and down their form is. Uh, Coulton Isle and Stoinis obviously slot straight in. Uh, I've gone back to Navdeep Saini instead of Umesh Yadav. A little bit unfortunate for Umesh Yadav, but I think Navdeep Saini, a little bit less baggage and a bit fresher, uh, looked quite good in the games that he played. Washington Sundar comes back for me uh, in that lineup uh, as well. Uh, hasn't had uh, a run yet. Uh, a lot of onus on some of the senior players. I've, I've, the two players that I've uh, picked to watch out for in this game is Hetmeyer. I hope RCB stick with him, uh, show a bit of faith in him. Uh, and give him another opportunity to open the innings uh, because if he can get going, he can be hell of a player uh, at the top of the order. The second one is A.B. De Villiers. I think uh, we all know what a great player A.B. has been over the years. Uh, but RCB need him to have a big season, uh, not only for their sake, but also sometimes take a little bit of pressure off uh, Virat Kohli. I think those two need to fire for RCB for them to have a good game. Uh, Favourites for me, uh, just slight favourites, Rajasthan Royals in the three losses that Rajasthan Royals have had uh, against the three that uh, RCB have. Uh, they seem to be, Rajasthan Royals seem to be performing a little bit better. Uh, not, to pick, not, not a lot to pick between the two teams, but I think Rajasthan starts slight favourites. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and leave your comments in the comment section below. Click on the bell icon for notifications.